This is a demonstration of OSG Earth um, running a animation camera animation path that I pre-recorded and is looking at the OpenStreetMap data. It's um, caching the data on a local file cache. Um, so most of the data shouldn't be streamed um, over the internet for this particular run of um, OSG Earth. The visualization with OSG Earth is actually doing a little bit of blending between um, different levels of detail um, to give you a bit of um, smooth blending between them. Um, the, I'm going to be comparing this with the uh, latest Vulcan Syngraph example OSG page LOD. Uh, that also streams the OpenStreetMap data and also does rendering. You'll see the differences between the two um, with the Vulcan SyncGraph version loading at a higher resolution by not doing the blending between the levels. The performance difference when I'm running with this camera animation path that's running between different cities is um, I'm getting um, 878 frames per minute uh, per second on the um, Open SyncGraph OSG Earth uh, path, which is running right now. When I run with the Vulcan SyncGraph path, which um, is about to complete, um, it runs at uh, 2,598 frames per second. This is on exactly the same um, animation path. Uh, visually, they're a little bit different um, because of the, um, the effects that um, OSG Earth is pr producing and also the different level of detail that um, they're pulling in. So the OSG Earth one's slightly lower level of detail, whereas the Vulcan Syngraph ones are slightly higher. So that's the animation path finished now. So I'll switch over to running the Vulcan Syngraph with the same animation path and the same data set, uh, but with different rendering. Um, straight away you'll notice the, um, a difference in the visuals, between it, even though it's the same data. Um, over this year, there's actually blending a uh, lower level of detail, um, so it produces a slightly different effect. I haven't yet compared how much data is there is different in terms of the actual level of detail, but visually it's clearly much higher in the, um, OSG, the VSG page LOD example. I have to um, mention just how impressive how much data there is available on OpenStreetMap, all available publicly on a, the Open server, OpenStreetMap server. Um, it's a little bit freaky because um, I've been testing the, the accuracy of the lats and longs of the projection in the, um, the Vulcan SyncGraphs implementation I'm using rendering right now. And I was able to actually locate my house using the exact lats and longs and it came up exactly as expected. Um, as you know, as intended, but it's kind of freaky the fact that you can actually download your house and your street um, location and get it exactly matched um, to lights and longs. Okay, this is um, wrapping up now. Just scanning across Sunnyvale. And thanks for watching.